Hi guys, welcome back to the channel and welcome to another video. So in this video, this is just going to be a very quick unboxing for you. I've just had this arrive today from 88 Films and it is of course the Jackie Chan movie Twin Dragons and it's one of those um, really lovely box set releases from 88 Films. So yeah, what I'm going to do is I'm basically just going to show you what you get in this release, what special features you get, what you get inside the box set and whether you think uh, it's worth picking up if you're a fan of the movie. So yeah, let's just get straight into it. So just very quickly on the movie itself. Now, I have to admit, I'm a huge Jackie Chan fan. I've seen many of his films. I love many of his movies. But this is one I've never seen before. I always remember seeing the, the VHS and DVD cover sort of back in the day uh, in video shops and blockbusters. And I seem to remember the cover. It had... Um, two Jackie Chans on it, one of them's holding a violin and the other's kind of got his fists out ready to fight. And I always got the impression from looking at that cover that this was one of Jackie Chan's American films um, and maybe one of his lesser American films, but it was only very recently I found out that this is actually one of his Hong Kong action comedies from the early 90s. And as soon as 88 Films announced this release, I knew I had to get it um, and I knew I had to see the movie because I had just gotten the complete wrong impression about this movie for such a long time. So yeah, I can't really comment on the movie itself, but I'm hoping it's going to be a good one. I'm sure it will be a lot of fun if it's one of his Hong Kong action comedies from the early 90s. I'm hoping it will be a lot of fun. So the first thing to show, of course, is this fantastic artwork on the front. This is done by Sean Longmore, who has done quite a lot of artwork for 88 Films, as well as numerous other Blu-ray companies. Um, I think he's made quite a name for himself this year because he designed a poster for Barbie and Oppenheimer, where he combined the, the two movies together in a, one poster. And I know that poster has been doing the rounds a lot on the Internet. Um, so it certainly made him a lot more popular this year, uh, more popular than he already is. Uh, but it's not hard to understand why, because his artwork is just absolutely fantastic. Uh, I love on this one how we've got sort of um, the duality going on here. So you've got the, um, the blue image here and then you flip it upside down and you've got the red image. Um, yeah, it's just fantastic. And then if you go on the back, there's even more artwork. And I really love how 88 Films um, will put artwork on the back of these box sets as well. Because I know some of the companies tend to, they tend to neglect the back of these box sets a little bit. But I love how 88 Films just kind of go that extra mile and put artwork on both sides of the box set. Uh, it's pretty awesome. So that's the, uh, the spine for you. Um, yeah, it's pretty awesome. So you do also get a J card with this release. Uh, I tend to remove the J cards. I'm not really a big fan of them um, being stuck to the box, especially when there's artwork on the back. Um, but on the back of the J card, you've just got all the sort of technical information, the special features. Um, so some of the special features you get, so you get Hong Kong cut of the film, you get the Dimensions version cut of the film, which is uh, about 15 minutes shorter. I'm guessing that's probably an American cut of the movie. You get numerous Cantonese mono um, language options. You get an English dub option. You get an audio commentary by Frank Jiang and FJ DeSanto, and they really know their stuff when it comes to Hong Kong cinema. You get an interview with actors Tung Wei and James Ha. You get a deleted scene from the Japanese version of the film. You get Taiwanese deleted scenes. And then there's a few sort of numerous archive interviews, archive behind the scenes footage and numerous trailers and TV spots. So inside the box set, you get an Amore case with reversible artwork. Um, I've already reversed this out. On the other side of the artwork, you just get this image, uh, but this is the alternate artwork. So this is kind of, um, looks like one of those original old school Hong Kong posters, which is pretty cool. That's the back. So again, Pretty much the same information, like technical information, special features, and then a few stills from the movie. And then when you open it up, you get disc art, so that's more artwork from Sean Longmore. And then you get some postcards, so I'll just quickly show you the postcards. So you get four postcards, and they're all double-sided. So this is the first one. Uh, it's the second one, looks like a, like a Japanese poster for the movie. Uh, another one, artwork from Sean Longmore again. Uh, and then you have this one here. And on the other side of the postcards, we have this one. We have this one. We have this one, which is pretty cool. 
and then we have this one. So again, just a little bit of extra effort from 88 Films, because sometimes when we get postcards, they tend to just be one-sided, but it's just great how these ones um, are double-sided, which is pretty cool. So yeah, those are the postcards. Next up inside the box set, we have a booklet. Uh, this is a fairly sizable booklet, it's about 80 pages, and you get a couple of essays, um, one about the movie itself, I think, and the other one, it looks to be about Jackie Chan and his 90s era of films. Uh, and there's a, a lot of information and a lot of great stills from the movie, it looks like. Um, but yeah, fantastic booklet, it looks like, again, lots of effort has gone into it. Um, you know, if, you're, uh, if you like reading, there's definitely a lot to digest in this one. Um, so yeah, awesome booklet uh, for this release. And then the last thing you get in this box set is a poster. Now, I have to admit... I am slightly disappointed in this, because uh, I do like my posters with these releases, uh, but it is a double-sided poster. Um, so we have this image on the first side, so again, it's like that classic old-school Hong Kong poster. And then on the other side, we have this image, which again looks like another sort of old-school um, poster from when the film came out. But the reason I'm disappointed is I was really hoping that Sean Longmore's art would be on one side of this poster, because as you can see behind me, I am a fan of his artwork and I was really um, looking forward to framing this one and putting it on the wall alongside these. So I am pretty disappointed that we haven't got Sean Longmore's um, artwork on the poster. But this is definitely still great and it's great if you, if you love the more sort of old school posters. I certainly do, but I just love Sean Longmore's artwork so much and uh, I was really hoping to get it on the poster. But it's not the end of the world, it's still a great poster. So there you go guys, that is just my very quick unboxing for Twin Dragons, released by 88 Films. Um, let me know in the comments below if you've seen this movie, what do you think of it, am I going to enjoy it? Um, let me know if you've picked up this release, what do you think of it, is it a good release from 88 Films? Um, but I really hope you've enjoyed the video, I hope it's been helpful if you've been thinking about picking this up. And yeah, thanks again for watching guys, so I will see you all again on the next one, so take care.